President Emerson Mnangagwa and his South African counterpart Cyril Ramaphosa on Tuesday held a private meeting in which the election of Zambia's opposition leader Hakainde Ichilema as the country's new leader among other issues became topical the City Times has learned. The two presidents who both lead revolutionary parties held a meeting on the sidelines of the Southern African Development Community 41st Summit of Heads of State and Government in Lilong Malawi. The meeting, sources said, was attended by Zimbabwe's Foreign Affairs Minister Frederick Shaba, Defense Minister Opam Chinguri Kashiri, and officials from the South African government. The election of Hichilema, according to diplomatic sources who spoke to the City Times, surprised Monangagwa and Ramaphosa, who both had cordial relations with Zambia's outgoing president, Edgar Lungu. Last week's election was Hichilema's sixth attempt at winning the presidency. The president-elect has strong connections with both Zimbabweans and South Africans' main opposition parties and discussions on how revolutionary parties like the ANC and ZANU-PF consolidate their positions were discussed. This election showed that political winds of change were ushered in by young people who are often accused of being reluctant to vote, a source familiar with the discussions said. The leaders also discussed Sadiq's role in the Mozambican conflict. If you may recall last month, South Africa's then Defense Minister Nosivi Wemapisa Nkakulu expressed their displeasure on why Rwandan troops had been deployed ahead of the regional bloc. In light of this, charting the way forward thus became paramount for the two leaders. In July, Rwanda announced that it would put boots on the ground to help stem a conflict which has claimed thousands of lives following weeks of dithering by the regional bloc. The conflict has also resulted in total a French headquartered energy group suspending its multi-billion dollar energy project in the region. Zimbabwe's presidential spokesperson George Charamba could not be reached for comment at the time of going to press. Hichilema, who won a landslide over incumbent Lungu, has close links to Musi Maimane, the leader of the opposition One South African movement. The president-elect is also an associate of MDC Alliance leader Nelson Chamisa. Hey. Munangagwa, who had a wafer-thin lead on Chamisa in the controversial 2018 general election, is expected to face his nemesis in the 2023 polls. In his acceptance speech, President-elect Ichilema extended an olive branch to his predecessor, who is in the past had tormented him. After the 2016 election, he was charged with treason for allegedly failing to give away to the presidential motorcade. He spent four months in a maximum security jail before the charges were dropped. Don't worry, you'll be okay. You won't face retribution or get tear gassed. Hichilema was often attacked in what he said were attempts to silence and intimidate him as an opposition leader said. He pledged to be the president of all Zambians, whether they voted for him or not. In its final tally, the Electoral Commission said Hichilema had won 